What's up, everybody? Welcome to a new English Beat. I'm Katya. In today's lesson, we're going to learn 10 synonyms to replace the adjectives fashionable and popular. Are you ready to enrich your vocabulary? If so, grab your vocabulary notebook and a pen and let's kick off. The first adjective on my list today that can be used to replace popular is all the rage. For example, Ed Sheeran's new album is all the rage. Number two, hip. For example, he took me to a hip restaurant for dinner. And here I've got one more example from the song I Bet You Think About Me by Taylor Swift in which she sings, scared not to be hip, scared to get old. And now let's move on to the third option, trendy. For example, Chelsea boots are trendy now. Number four, we can also say on trend. For example, the new movie, Don't Look Up, is on trend. Number five, in vogue, which means popular and fashionable. We can also say to come into vogue. For example, slouchy jeans came into vogue in 2019. Apart from in vogue, we can also say voguish. For example, ghosting is a voguish word. Ghosting means that someone disappears out of your life without an explanation. And guys, before we continue and learn five more synonyms, just a super quick reminder, please make sure you subscribe to English Bits if you like my channel. And if you enjoy this lesson, please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. Thank you. And now let's continue and learn five more alternatives. Number six, in, which means fashionable. One simple sentence, white socks and black pants are in this season. Number seven, stylish. For example, Emily is famous for her stylish outfits. Number eight, funky. It means cool, trendy and a bit different. Let's put it into simple sentence. Your sneakers are very funky. Tomorrow to go, number nine, the latest craze. It means an idea, activity or object that is extremely popular, usually for a short time. One simple sentence, distressed sweaters are the latest craze. And last but not least, number 10, we can also say the latest thing or the latest fad. For example, YouTube shorts are the latest fad. And before we finish, I've got an idiom that has something to do with fashion and trends. And it's to jump on the bandwagon, which means to join in with a trend or a popular activity. One simple sentence, YouTube shorts are on trend and I decided to jump on the bandwagon. So guys, that's it for today. I really hope you enjoyed this short lesson and learned some new adjectives. If you did, please don't forget to like this video, to subscribe to English Bits and catch me on Instagram where I teach English every day. Thank you for watching this English Bit and see you next Sunday. Ciao for now!